The take a knee trend continues in Chicago today. Here you see several retired police officers sending a message. Our political reporter Derek Blakely takes us to Chicago Police Headquarters. They gathered in unity and fellowship. My brother. Yes, what's up? More than 20 retired black cops outside police headquarters to make a statement about patriotism and protest and free speech. We're here to show solidarity for the First Amendment. We should be able to do that without question, and nobody should come to us and say it's wrong. So we're going to do this, everybody on your right knee, and we'll help each other. Right. So as the sun glinted off the stars and stripes nearby, kneel they did. Most not here in reaction to the two black officers who earlier this week joined a protesting citizen or the discipline they received. You can't protest, I would say, or demonstrate in uniform because you're representing the organization. However, get that son of a off the field. Did President Trump's intervention in this issue take it to another level for you? Absolutely. Who is Donald Trump to tell anyone what they can and cannot do when he received five deferments? And in their kneeling, a lesson on patriotism. These men and women here are true patriots, okay, because they put their lives on the line for so many years and protecting people's right to preach. And that's why I'm here. You know, because people haven't, you know, we, we have the right to speak out. The retired officers say their demonstration was also in support of active police officers who do their job right and have the courage to point out injustice when they see it, even within their own department. Rob and Mai, they very much want their action to be seen as a positive, a positive one, a positive gesture. All right, Derek, thanks.